This is a water lateral. The water lateral is the pipe that brings water from the water main in the street into your home. Here you see a water shutoff valve. This valve can stop water from entering the home. Many homes in HRM have a pressure reducing valve, shown here, which lowers the water pressure to an appropriate level for the building. Next, we see the water meter. We'll talk more about this later. The water meter is followed by an isolation valve. Most homes built after 1996 have one of these. Next is a dual check valve, which prevents water from leaving the plumbing in the home and potentially contaminating the public water distribution system. It acts as a backflow prevention device. From here, the water continues into the rest of the plumbing in your home, providing water to sinks, toilets, laundry machines, dishwashers, and more. Let's talk about how water is measured as it enters your home. Water flows through the water lateral and into the water meter. All of the water that enters your home is measured. The water that passes through the water meter spins a built-in device. Each spin of the device measures a specific amount of water. That amount is instantly shown on the display on top of the water meter in cubic meters. One cubic meter is equal to 1,000 liters. To see your total water usage, lift the black plastic cover on the water meter and shine a powerful flashlight on the screen to turn it on. The number shown is the total amount of water that has gone through the meter since its installation. The only way for water to be measured is for it to flow through the meter, physically spinning the device. Take a look at this example. When the tap is on, water flows through the water meter. When the tap is turned off, water stops passing through the water meter. Now let's see what it might look like if a home had a leaking faucet elsewhere in the home. When we turned the sink off, the flow of water through the meter slowed down, but because of that leaking faucet, some water is still being used. All water that is used by a property whether it is intentional or not, is measured by the water meter. A few times a day, water meter readings are transmitted to Halifax Water. The information from the water meter goes down a wire toward the encoder transmitter box. The encoder transmitter is a small gray plastic box that is typically mounted outside of the home. It sends the water meter readings to Halifax Water. The encoder transmitter box only transmits information for about six minutes in total every day. This regular transmission of data allows Halifax Water to alert customers if a larger than normal amount of water is flowing through the water meter. This could indicate that there is a broken pipe, a leaking toilet, a dripping faucet, or some other source of increased water use. Even a small leak can really add up over time. To sign up for leak alerts, to view your water consumption data, and more, register for Customer Connect by visiting customerconnect.halifaxwater.ca.